Hello, just a quick update today of our DWC um, DIY pot. We moved the kale into it from the RDWC containers that have now been packed away. Uh, the video on the DIY DWC is back in the playlist, link in the description, and also the breakdown of the RDWC. I just wanted to show you the kale, and um, it's drunk all the water in there, so we need to top it up with more. Yeah, I'll just show you how it's going. Yeah, so if you've seen the DWC video, you'll know that this plant here is from the RDWC, and that's one plant on its own. And this one on the right has actually two plants in, uh, three, sorry. And yeah, they're, they're all doing fantastically. These leaves are huge, looking healthy. A few at the bottom have gone a bit yellow, but that's to be expected. They don't get any light. That one's come off. Um, yeah, I'll go around the corner and show you the roots and then we'll top up the water. I'll lift up the plants and you can hopefully get a good look at the root system. Yeah. Nice and healthy. So we can just move this lid to one side and top up the water. Um, we're probably going to be harvesting this kale relatively soon. So um, we'll just top up this once more and then uh, yeah, I'll show you what I like to do with kale leaves in another video and uh, the kids like them as well. Okay, let's get some water. Okay, so we've got a 20 litre watering can here and um, we're going to use our Terra Aquatica tripart grow. Micro. bloom. I'll put these into the empty watering can and then when I mix the water in they'll get nice and mixed up in there. Cool. Okay, so I've got my water ready, and like I said, I'm just going to move the whole lid to one side. Um, I'm probably in the next week, probably going to harvest this and make it into chips and various meals. Uh, and I'll show you that but for now. Let's put this water in, make sure they stay alive. <laughs> 